I can't believe school's finally out. Even my homework has homework. Where can a kid go to catch a break this summer? Ain't that a mouthful, kids? I built the funnest camp on Earth just for you. And parents, camp with Petey Kaka Waka Wissam. I camp. We'll have you rejuvenated in no time. I'm home. <laughs> Are you catching a cold, sweetie? Check out what I bought for family camp. It's an electronic bear repellent. It's guaranteed to work against even the biggest grizzly. Shoe bear, shoe. Why'd you buy all that junk? We're only taking the essentials with us. <laughs> right, like the vacuum cleaner. Do you have any idea how much dirt there is in the woods? Getting dirty is the fun part. Me not, no, no, no. Who's my favorite genetically manipulated mutant girl? Who's my sweetie? You are? Yes, that's right. You can just have one treat. I don't want you to spoil your appetite. If you need me, I'll be in my room. Oh, speaking of which, here's your dinner now. I hope you've left room. Were you growling? No more red meat for you. Once again, bumbling ignorance unwittingly prevails against superior intellect. Bravo, my clueless little friend. Why can't you talk like normal people? You better be on your best behavior at camp, or I'm leaving you in the woods for the grizzly bears. What could I possibly get into? You've already confiscated my death ray and my home nuclear fission set. Besides, I plan to work on a little gardening project of my own. A nice, uh, outfit. I've never seen shorts with a crease before. My mom's worried I'll turn into wolf boy at camp. She even ironed my underwear, and she used way too much starch. Luckily, I'm not gonna have that problem. We've been over this, Beanie. You're bringing clean underwear for each day. What? Do I even own that many pairs? Your top drawer on the left. Go. We're leaving soon. Now, Beanie! <gasps> Boy, I'll bet other kids' moms don't nag them about underwear and taking baths and stuff. You're taking baths, too! Oh. <sighs> there. That should do it. Phew. Ah. Last but not least... You're taking your goldfish with you? Well, duh. You don't think I'd leave him out of my sight for a whole week? There wouldn't be a town left to come back to. Right. What was I thinking? The bus is here, guys! I, I get, get the, the window, window seat! seat. <laughs> uh, 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 stupid clean underwear. <laughs> the wheels on the bus go wobbling round, wobbling round, wobbling round. The wheels on the bus go wobbling round. All through the town. Oh. Welcome to camp with Peter Welcome to camp with Peter Kakawaka Wiki Mako Wikis. I've got to change that name. Every single bump on the way here. <gasps> the brochure definitely does not do this place justice. Doesn't it, though? Would you believe this place used to be a lumberjack camp? Converted everything with my own two hands, I did. <laughs> Kids, why don't you settle in while I show your parents to their barracks? <laughs> Seven pairs of underwear. <laughs> Okay, parents, right this way. Whoa! I call top bunk. I called it first. Not fair. You get to sit over the hole in the floor on the bus. Whoa! Whoa! Oh. Awesome! <laughs> <laughs> 
By the sound of it, Beanie's found his intellectual equals. Maybe by putting their heads together, they can scrounge up enough IQ points to tie one shoe. This place will be perfect for my little gardening experiment. Why bother with a couple of potted plants when I can have one million snapping dandelions at my command? No, wait. Even better. One million snapping poison ivies. People will be scratching so hard, they won't be able to run from my carnivorous army. Ah, uh, yes? <laughs> How about the sound of my violent rhetoric? Do you think that would attract attention? You're lumbering like a caveman, and it's making me seasick. Fish can't get seasick. Right. This looks like a good place for lunch. <sighs> How come bugs aren't bothering you? Did you use repellent? Nope. Just a little detect man cologne, as usual. Hey, you. It smells just like grown-ups. Speaking of which, I wonder how they're enjoying themselves. <laughs> Sorry, I uh, guess they moved in here to get away from the snake infestation. Uh, which reminds me, uh, watch where you step. <gasps> I don't care if there are poisonous man-eating tigers lurking around. I'm tired, I'm dirty, and I need some place to freshen up. Oh, right, uh, where are my manners? Uh, right around the corner, uh, I just put in a new roll of toilet paper. Huh? This is it. I'm calling my husband to come get me and my daughter. We're not staying in this snake pit one second longer. Actually, cell phones don't work out here, but I think there's a phone in the spa house. The spa house? This was here when I bought the land. Boy, those lumberjacks must have had a really good union. Kind of pointless now, if you ask me. <laughs> Uh, didn't want to use the phone to get a ride out of here? Well, a few snakes never hurt anyone. But children need the formative experience. <laughs> I don't get it. Who comes to the great outdoors to lock themselves indoors? Don't you worry. There's a cabin over the hill that'll be perfect for you. No electricity, no running water. It'll be fun, just like the settlers used to live. That would be why the settlers only lived till 35. How can I get down to business with the little nincompoop watching me like a hawk? Maybe I need a little helping hand. Uh, is it supposed to burn so much? Oh, only for a couple of months, until your immune system kicks in. Hey, no, stop! He's gone! You just drag him! What are you, a circus freak? He's huge! That should keep him off my back while I work on my super breed of carnivorous poison ivy. All I need now is raw material. That's funny. I could swear that was a shortcut. How can you stand all the... Bugs! They're attracted by your perfume. Try this. Bug spray. Great! Oh, even better. It's made from the sweat of 12 different animals. When in nature, you have to smell like nature. Check this out. I don't know, guys. It's gross, but not barf out gross. Remember that movie where a guy ate a radioactive egg and a chicken jumped out of his stomach? Well, that's nothing compared to what this fish is going to do to you if we don't get him out. I guess. I mean, I don't even ask questions anymore. Okay, let me see the spaghetti again, but add more blueberry yogurt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Little do soccer moms know, the snacks they put in Junior's lunchbox provide all the chemicals I need. Thank you. Sodium sterol lactylate? Ooh, I should have worn gloves.
And now, the secret ingredient. Perfect. I'll make a million just like you, and the woods will become my army. No, you clumsy bottle! Look what you've done. You've washed away my upcoming army. A magnificent plan, ruined by... Yes! <laughs> Once again, I've outdone myself. Come here. You must be feeling peckish. There's someone I'd like you to meet. His name's Beanie. He'll make such a nice snack. Good idea! Why walk when we can run? like Admiral Bubbles to stay quiet for so long. He should have pulled that kid inside out with his tongue by now. Uh-huh. I hate it when that happens. What the? Hello, Beanie. <laughs> Miss me. How did... What are you trying to pull here? What? Don't mind my new friend. He doesn't bite. Much. <laughs> Quit horsing around, Beanie. Guys, I think the prune juice is starting to take effect. Who turned out the lights? Let's get out of here! Wait! We only want to play. Did you uh, hear something? Kids playing. Yeah, I'm glad they're enjoying themselves, too. I think I'm starting to make sense of this map. Is that the cabin? Or a squashed bug. Fortunately for us, I have my trusty Canadian Army knife. <laughs> that kid didn't swallow Admiral Bubbles. That's just what he wanted us to believe while he was creating mutant poison ivy. What? You mean you didn't see the thing that chased us? Green with four heads and fangs? Oh. In case you haven't noticed, I'm wearing a chimney on my head. I need something to fight it with. Bingo! Hello? Special delivery. Ah. <laughs> Consider yourself downsized. <laughs> Well, what do you know? We can form doubles for tennis now. Oops. Uh, Wait, I'll put it out. Oh. Well, so much for the map. Uh, sorry. So much for our water as well. Uh, um, the upside is now we know how to make a signal fire, <laughs> right? <laughs> Beanie! Mom, what, what are you doing here? here? What? You poor dear, what happened to you? Giant poison ivy with claws and fangs, Mom! Admiral Bubbles created them and now they're chasing us! Come on, I'll show you! I didn't see it, Mrs. O. Heck, I could barely hear anything with that thing on. Well, except for Beanie screaming a lot. Are you telling me that you brought your goldfish to camp while you're on triple ultra probation? Do you know what one more stripe would mean to your social life for the next two years? Uh, uh, uh no, of course not. Oh, he's at home being fed by, uh, Mia. Yeah, uh, we just fell on a patch of poison ivy. <laughs> uh, a patch of poison ivy? Oh, my allergies. Oh, I'll be stuffed up for days. Okay, time to take charge. Which way do we go? Uh, left. I'm absolutely sure of it. Right it is. Uh, not that way. That's the swamp. I know these woods like the back of my... Huh. Allergies, huh? Can I borrow this for a while? Sure, I've got plenty more. 
How difficult can it be to track a child who probably hasn't bathed in a week? Would it kill you guys to show up at the right place at the right time? But no! I'm the one who's got to look like a lunatic again! Oh, wait, about that bathing remark. This stuff is guaranteed to treat any allergies. Ragweed, pollen, pet danders, you. Hello. I don't suppose you'd let me get a refill, would you? Okay, fine, you win. Yes, I do. What is this? The Terminator? He's got my undying determination. Look out! Behind you! It's like looking in a mirror. Uh-oh. What do you mean? Huh? Okay, enough playing with your food. Time to be rid of the boy once and for all. Not me, you chlorophyll-brained idiot! I think it just acquired a taste for fish. How humiliating! I just dropped from supreme being to the bottom of the food chain. I'm supposed to be ruling the world and not feeding it. Yeah, about that. How long can you hold your breath out of water? Uh, because I don't think it's going anywhere anytime soon. Don't you think I have a plan? I have a plan. A very good plan. Plan have I. Half plan will travel. I'm a planning machine. Well... Okay, so maybe I don't have one. How could I think with that maniacal fern pacing up and down like that? I have one. Okay, fine. You have to promise. No evil plans for the rest of the summer. Fine. No evil plans. I need a vacation anyway. I agree, but only for the summer. So what's your plan? Hey, you! Is it true your mother was a dandelion? I'm sorry, did I say dandelion? I meant to say that your mother was crabgrass. I told you that was a good decoy. Not bad for finger painting with crushed berries. Pshaw. You painted me cross-eyed, and my nose isn't that big. This one's called Shady Forest After Summer Rain. Hmm. Smells just like the real thing, but without the poison ivy. You finally found your calling, Barry. Now I feel like I'm abusing your hospitality. Oh, no, 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 tut, tut, tut. You are my guests of honor. You made me realize something. Everyone loves nature, but only when seen through the windows of an air-conditioned luxury spa. <laughs> I'm booked solid until next year. I don't get grown-ups. Look at them. Yeah, what's fun about all that? Okay, kids, time for a good old mud fight. <laughs> I can't stand coconut. <laughs> this is going to be one long vacation.